Let's look at some old photos going back to 1974, that area, circa 1973 to 1975. Here we have, besides Stevie Wonder, we have a Motown record executive, and he was the president between 1973 and 1975. His name is Ewart Abner, Jr., now, I'm not sure who that is right there on the left, but th these are mostly pictures of Stevie Wonder. And uh, Abner was also Stevie Wonder's manager for 10 years. So there's uh, Abner in the middle. Probably a couple more record executives. You know, if you know who they are, leave a comment, please. That's Abner on the left. Now, I don't know who this bright perky sunshine on the right here is but if anybody knows who that beautiful creature is hey leave please uh, leave a comment i mean it could be abner's girlfriend it could even be uh stevie wonder's girlfriend now here's uh abner's girlfriend going back to the 50s we're going to talk about his record executive career in a moment this is stevie wonder's first wife i believe so again let's talk about ewart abner jr he was born in 1923 in chicago He's not in this picture, of course, that's uh, Stevie Wonder. I don't know who the other people are in there. But, um, okay, there's Abner in the middle with a couple other uh, probably Detroit record executives. Again, Abner in the middle, born in Chicago, 1923. He died in 1997. He was uh, Motown's president, again, between 1973 and 1975. There he is on the left. He directed the careers of many people, Smokey Robinson. Now here he is with that lovely creature again. Is that his girlfriend or is that Stevie Wonder's girlfriend? Ooh, Motown president, Ewart Abner Jr. Let's talk about it some more. Ooh, doggy, ain't she pretty? Now remember, this is circa 1973, 74, 75. I mean, you've never seen pictures like this before. That's why you come to my channel to see stuff like this, okay? We know the time frame because Abner was the uh, president of Motown Records during those years. Let's take a look. Okay, remember, he uh, directed the careers of many people like Smokey Robinson. There's Smokey on the left, Abner in the middle. He directed careers like uh, people like Marvin Gaye, The Miracles, The Temptations, The Jackson Five, Diana Ross. He was the son of a minister. He dropped out of college to uh, join the war effort in World War II when he joined the military. Okay, who, what do we got here again? Okay, there's Abner on the left, Stevie in the middle. There's, uh, now he remember, he was Stevie Wonder's manager for 10 years after he left. Uh, Motown being the president of Motown Records. Now, these are some amazing photographs going way, way back to 1970s. If you like these pictures, uh, hit the uh, subscribe button. Subscribe to my channel and and uh, hit the like because maybe I can show you some more pictures. If you want to see these pictures, these are coming from Las Vegas. Never before seen photos ever. And you want to see more of this, subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Who's that guy in the left? Doesn't he look like that artist, um, Neiman? It's not Neiman, but anyhow, he, he looked familiar to that guy there. If anybody knows who he is, uh, leave a comment. There's uh, Abner on the left again. This was an amazing uh, flashback to 1974. Stevie Wonder, Motown, Ewart Abner Jr., the president of Motown Records between 1973 and 75. I hope you enjoyed it. Again, we'll, I'll see you in a little bit. I'll sh I got some more photos from Las Vegas with these entertainers and these famous people. If you want to see more, again, subscribe to the channel.